right, look at this beautiful day. What's going on guys? How's it going? Mark Freeman 408. Justin Bucher, 25. You are Canadian AF, aren't you? Yeah. Aren't you? <laughs> Where are you going? Looks like we had a party here last night. <laughs> There's always cars here. Um, where was I? If you're new to this channel, make sure you subscribe, hit notifications. We do eight videos a week. We do a lot of car stuff, a lot of moto stuff. Um, sorry for all the car stuff lately. I know some guys really want motos, some guys want this, some guys want that. We've, uh, we've been super busy and just trying to bang out car stuff recently with the demo derby and all the jumps and stuff, but I am going to start adding in moto stuff, you know, once or twice a week. So I just, <clears throat> I haven't rode in like over a month now rode my dirt bike so it has been super busy but we've been getting stuff done we've been arranging stuff and guess what the stuff for the maverick came in so the boys at evil power sports were generous enough to send us a turbo purge for a blow-off valve with some yellow tubing this is the blow-off valve so all this stuff goes in thursday and then they sent in a tuner so we're going to be up to 200 horsepower now so if you guys want to check out evil power sports if you have a maverick or any side by side they they are one of the best companies to do well tuning or anything um yeah i'm excited this thing will be fast as hell <laughs> um, we got rims and tires coming for it hopefully this week they'll be here as well and then also check out heat shield these guys Heat shield products. So they do all the heat shields, as you can see, they do heat wrap for mufflers or whatever you want to wrap. So they do great work. Great stuff. The it's link is below if you guys need any of that stuff. Justin, should we wrap you in heat shield? Wrap me in t-shirts and then heat shield. You want to wrap you in t-shirts? Yeah. <laughs> uh, other than that, yeah, we got a new Saturn. We picked it up before we headed to Muskoka on the weekend. Did some uh, parking lot deals as always, so uh, we got a pretty good deal on it. So we're gonna go grab that, rip down the track. Someone suggested doing a Rockford over a jump. So I think I'm gonna try that today. We'll do, uh, yeah. You good with that? Yeah, yeah, okay. It's like a little hard to understand how we're gonna do it. I'm not quite sure yet, but we're gonna try. So basically I'll have it in reverse. I'll spin it around as I'm going off the jump. Might roll, might not, might just blow the tires off it, but you know, you gotta pay to play, right, yeah. Justin? Still gonna send it. Still gonna send it, so. <clears throat> we also have light bars for this thing. So I have three. Obviously, I'm just gonna put one on. Uh, the curved one on the front, uh, we were gonna put one on the back, but I decided against it. So if you guys wanna follow Ox Lighting too, there's a little thing right here. Yeah, these guys. Ox Beam. So. I'll, I'll put all the links below. You can check them out if you have side-by-sides and toys and you want to mod them out. Those are your guys. Anyways, let's head down the track. We'll grab the Saturn and we'll send it. Why is there, why is there bolt up here? I don't know. Got to keep her tight. Huh. We're doing some hitch things. Get her on there. There's the new car. That's a Saturn, right? I can't even keep track of these cars now. Oh yeah, load her up. I like that shirt, that's a good shirt. That's a good shirt, I like yeah. it. For any of you Canadians out there, that's your go-to. Anyway, he's on our way home the other night and apparently the strap broke. <laughs> Look at that. So what I think happened is that these are really long straps. I think they're like 12 or 14 feet. So I always do a slip knot and I was kind of in a rush the other night. I think it unslipped, kind of like that one, as you can see. And it must have went under the tire and just ripped right off because, yeah, it kind of looks like he got pulled on here. But, um, oh well, we didn't lose the tire, so that's always a win. And yeah, got this thing for 200 bucks. Yeah. Apparently the bottom's pretty rotten, but other that's than that. Not only had a thousand cigarettes smoked in it so it's not too bad but uh yeah anyone need a hot air balloon ride there's your there's your go-to right there cloud chasers yeah. um the saturn view yeah it's a good car you check out the cat is it going to be easy to cut off 
Yeah, it's right up front there. Is it? It's the not. Front. It's not all up underneath. I think we're driving people crazy using the strap to rip them off and ruining the strap. So we're gonna get a chain and really? do it the right way. You can spend sixty dollars at a time. Yeah. Well, the strap was on sale. It only cost me twenty bucks. Then you make a few hundred off of the cat. Yeah, so there. Where? Oh yeah, there it is. That should be easy. Hey, looks like a snowmobile cat. Surprised no one's stolen it yet. <laughs> All right, let's get this thing unloaded. Yeah, I pulled those in. Yeah. Ten more horsepower. Exactly. I like to check some cars out to see what you have. Never yeah. Know. Looking for changes. Why do you have an apartment down here? That's your wallet. Your wallet for smokes. Yeah, darts. I'm gonna start smoking so I can take advantage of this. I know. Like some sort of princess stuff. All right. Traction control button has been located. You good to go? Starts good. Look at that. Starts better than that Dodge. It does, yeah. Might take your deck out. It's a pretty nice deck you got there. See me rolling, rolling, rolling. Oh, yeah. That's how the old pros do it. Perfect. Don't hit the balloon signs. You squawk it? <laughs> Probably do it on the sand. <laughs> All right, let's head down there. Yeah, pretty nice deck in here, eh? Yeah, it's a great. You gonna deck. take that deck? Colorful, yeah. big deck. This is a big deck. Flashy right, deck. Let's go for a scoot. dare for sure back up to her yeah I think the dirt needs to come up to like almost here we basically you just ram it with the bumper and we're gonna knock the tires out oh yeah give her a whirl See, no no stuff's good in there Oh, we got to do the uh, the burnout too. Every new car we got, we do a massive burnout with it. Just, just cause. Just Canada. <laughs> Your turbo was a little loud there. <laughs> no, I think the muffler was just pushed up against it. Yeah, yeah. Let's just wait because these tires are gonna go flying, and then you're gonna have to collect them. Yeah. Um, let's do burnout with it. Yeah, I'll. Uh, I need to maybe dig it out more, put the tires a little lower, oh, then put yeah. more dirt on it. What's that? <laughs> Didn't want to go in gear? Yeah, it's front wheel. They see me burning. Get her squealing.
Oh man. I love burnouts. Couple burnies for the boys. <laughs> there he goes. Chirp, chirp. People must think we're having fires down here all the time because like, there's always a giant plume of smoke. I can't imagine driving by it here when we're down here ripping and people would be like, what the, what the hell are they doing now? There's big flames, fires. Never, never know what's going on. Did it pass the Freeman compound initiation? Burnout? That was a good burn it. I think it was only one wheeler, but uh, hey, still better than none. She uh, doesn't like to shift from anything else to drive. It's like a big delay. It takes like three seconds for it to actually engage. Really? So Rockford might suck. She's been beat on. Let's see this tire. Oh, plenty of lights left in it. Doesn't even look like you did a burnout. <clears throat> I think we should do the Rockford with the Malibu. Yeah, I'd say that or would the, be a better bet. Whatever the hell that thing is. I'm going to call it the uh, Impalibu. Impalibu? Impalibu, yeah. We should check our, make sure we don't have any fires there. I like a good fire. Someone's clunking in the back. I heard that. It's more of a tick right now. We're good. Probably just cooling down. Maybe. You're shooting a lot of burning rubber, so it might be, oh, yeah. might be uh, singeing away. Oh, yeah, no fires here. All good, Robin Hood. Whew. All right, let's fire up the Impalibu, and uh, I guess we'll do the Rockford for you guys. You reverse Rockford. I don't know who suggested it, but I was like, that is a great idea. That's a great idea, Justin. The best idea. Look at that shirt. Spot on. I didn't burn hey? it this morning, I'm sorry. I'll yeah, try better well. next time. Didn't you wear that the other day? No. No. It's fresh. Freshy. Fresh obsessed. Only fresh clothes down the track. Freshy clothing. Yeah, so we'll pile up some more dirt on that thing and then we'll we'll teeter totter the hell out of it. At least halfway up. Well I was thinking I'm gonna dig it deeper so the tires are actually a little lower. That way you're not like shooting all the way up and then doing it because yeah <laughs> like you're really just gonna knock those tires right out you can see they've already moved a bunch so yeah. yeah i'll dig it down another foot maybe and then we'll put a lot more dirt up there and then we'll get teeter-tottering because the thumbnail looks hilarious when you teeter-totter a car it's a little sketchy but it's worth it yeah we've never had a bad incident yet so yeah never. all right let's fire up the boo now we're stealing stuff. Getting the stereo out of here. I just leave a quarter on the dash, eh? Okay, yeah. <laughs> Pretty nice deck. Great deck. And fancy deck. Colorful deck. There we go. Clonadian AF. What? Huh? What'd you say? What'd you say to me? What didn't you say to me? What didn't you say? Hey, do the old trucker bang. Tire's good. Mm-hmm. Yeah, dent there. Since Brad's gone for the week. Oh, man. That lady was right. Apparently the Saturns are undentable. <laughs> hey, that lady was right last night. Apparently you can't dent the Saturn. What? Yeah. yeah. They just bend right back. This thing's all plastic. I creased it. Good enough. Oh, we'll, we'll put a good dent in there. Deck tire. Good. Hey, you got that thing out there yet? Yeah, I do. I should probably turn the car off before I have. Uh... Well, I want to see get a little shock. A little shock. Oh, good. Yeah, that feels good. Maybe I wanted that piece. Good, good. Good, good, good. New Subaru deck. Oh, yeah. Need any of that wire? Uh, just checking. <laughs> <laughs> you never really know. I'll take this. Take the blue thing. It yeah. may come in handy. I, well, this is the wiring harness, so we're good. <laughs> Watch, that. the car's not going to run now. Oh, yeah. Sure. Should probably check that. <laughs> yeah. Still runs. All Let right. We got the boo. Dun, 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 dun. So we tried getting the Subaru running again. We put a fresh battery in it. The battery that was in it, the whole bottom was like melted right out of it. So she was a scarooed. 
Should we move this car jump right to the edge here? That's like another 100 feet of run. That would be sick. Anyways, Malibu, let's see. Let's do this. Oh, it actually smells half decent in here. That's good. How many freaking keys we got going here? Well, apparently these are the wrong keys. Good thing I got more. All the Chevy keys. Oh yeah, this thing's straight piped. <laughs> Let's roll. So this is the jump we were thinking of doing it over. So I don't know if you guys remember when we had a parked car right here and I came flying in reverse, hit this, landed on top of the car. Well, I think I fell off once or twice, but uh, yeah, it was pretty funny. So we had a comment the other day, you guys should try a reverse Rockford in a car over a jump. So I figured why not this little single one right here. And you're hung up. That was a little too hard. <laughs> I'll come give you a boost in a second. So yeah, basically I'll come flying in here. I'll turn and see what happens. I might roll, I might not. I got my helmet, we're ready to go. You ready to go, Justin? Yeah, I, I done screwed up. Yeah, <laughs> I'll come give you a push. I just wanna get the top grass off for you. Oh yeah, you got her off. Bingo. <laughs> little pocket pull? Oh, pocket key. Pocket Chevys. Alright, I feel like I'm just gonna rip the tires off, so if that happens, well, I hope the video is worth it. <laughs> what are your bets, Justin? I'm not gonna say anything. You're not gonna say anything? No. You don't wanna jinx it? Nope. Ugh. Do you want me to take your hat and glasses? Yeah, probably take those, eh? Yeah. They see me rolling Thank you. into Malibu. Thank this thing's got a full tank of gas, eh? Really? Yeah. Perfect. Thanks, Scott Motorsports, for encouraging your bad ideas with providing protection. Protecting my noggin. Good luck. Get on the other side. I'm going to try a Rockford up there first. Okay. Take one. Smash out the back window. This is why we have more than one car down here. Hey! Try again? Try again? How was it? That's pretty cool. It's got like you did a 360 on the top of it. Yeah. Or 180 or whatever that number is. It's weird with the hill and everything. Yeah, I'm gonna stay in here and film. Thing sounds like a bit of a the kid. You ever blow bubbles into like a cup of a straw? Like blah, 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 blah. That's what it sounds like. Sorry about the pylon, Freeman. There we go. <laughs> well, that tire's done. That was pretty sweet. <laughs> We're not jumping this though. Will we just rip it off? I mean, she's still there. Oh yeah. <laughs> I kind of had a feeling either that was gonna happen or the tire was gonna rip off the bead, but that felt like it was pretty high. It so looked pretty good. It felt good. It went better than I thought. Yeah. Like I thought you might catch and then just kind of slow it's, it's roll down back. It's kind of weird because it's like a peak. So like when you're swinging around, the front end wants to go up and then like kind of get slammed down. Like, I don't know, physics, math, words. Something about algebra. Al algebra. Algebra. Ah, uh, well, uh, yeah. That car's not getting jumped. No. I think I got a bird in my freaking... A bird? Or a bur oh, a bird. He's a poop. beetle? Might have been a beetle. Well, closely assessed the damage there. I guess Hope so. you guys enjoyed that. <laughs>
That actually went pretty good. It was a good. It was, I got rocked in there pretty good, but uh, glad I wore my helmet. Yeah. It was more bad when the front end came down because it was like. Yeah, I looked total aggressive. I thought you were going to flip it. I Yeah, it was up there. I, uh, <laughs> I for sure thought I was going to flip it. That's oh, why I, I wore my helmet. I hit your cone. Sorry. My, my cone? Your cone. Um, well, I don't want the video to end yet. Let's do another burnout in that thing and then we'll. Uh, you um, think you'll. I doubt you'll be able to push me, eh? We can try it. Maybe come around that side, push the front end over. Yeah. And then. We'll try and push it down there. Down there? Just you so, want it up by the fence, so it's easy to load. Uh, I'd like to keep it with the rest of the cars. All right. Well, so it doesn't look talking. like a full-blown scrapyard down here. But that's what we're going for. I know. <laughs> okay. Ever since you mentioned that cone, I just want an ice cream cone now. <laughs> you want an ice cream cone because you hit that cone? <laughs> oh, man. Who's got a bushwhacker? If anyone's got a bushwhacker, bring it over. We'll cut some lawn. <laughs> yeah, I definitely thought figured this was gonna happen. I mean, this car would have been sweet to jump, but you know, you gotta change things up now and again. <laughs> oh man, good times. Good times had by all. There you go. Oh, the Saturn is not undentable because that, that's a dent, it's a dent. <laughs> yeah, all right, see if you can uh, push it forward now. Oh! Is that yours? I don't know. Is there a cat? Thing? Oh, it's hot! <laughs> One of ours. Yeah, that's uh, your pipe there. <laughs> We're moving now. She drove for about 30 seconds there, and then I think I just snapped off the shaft or whatever on the front there, so. The old Saturn's pushing. Oh, that might be it. Oh yeah. Just pushing away here. So, sorry we've been doing so much car stuff lately. It's just kind of uh, been what it's been. Track is getting remapped at some point here. Oh, ram them a bit here. And uh, hopefully once to, Dozer comes in, we rebuild the car jump and fix the track up. We'll be able to rip bikes and stuff a little more. I'm looking at getting like a pit bike, like a 110 or something. So maybe we can build a pit bike track or something like that. And uh, I don't know, add some more content in. If you guys have any ideas on things you'd like to see swapped around here at the track or built, write a comment, leave a thumbs up. And uh, yeah, always enjoy positive feedback. Ugh, just pushing away here. It is dusty down here. Look at that. Oh, oh. I'm getting pretty good at backing up here. Oh. Oh. Well, I'd say that went pretty good. All things considered, ah, oh, you really can't dent the Kia. Too bad. And then there's the Malibu. Malibu! That was like best case scenario. That went really well. Best case Ontario. Hey, okay. another key for the collection. Another key. <laughs> we started the key collection. What, how many vehicles have we bought this year or have had at the year? compound? All together or this year? All together at the track. Jumped or not jumped? Probably, I think we bought like 20, and then we smashed probably 50. All right. so. And then there's like probably five or 10 that never made it anywhere. They just blew apart on the trailer. Yeah, yeah. Well, the sport track got here, we did half a donut and then the train. Yeah. Subaru anyway, so. went on the trailer and didn't yeah, come Subaru off. Subaru drove under the trailer and then it came off and there she lies. So. This is just a paint mural. You can't, yeah, you can't, uh, with scrap cars, you never really know what you're gonna get. You know, sometimes you win, sometimes, sometimes you lose. <laughs> yeah. But uh, no, it's good. Let's do another burn it and then we'll wrap it up. All right, sounds good. Get you home. Get me home. Get you. <laughs> get me. Get you me can on sleep the high in hook. your own bed for the first time oh. in a few weeks. Well, that was fun. I got a little bit rocked there, but uh, it turned out well. So, are you happy, Justin? I'm always happy. You happy? I'm happy. 
Pretty good. Good to go. Look at that, that was bigger than the first one. They should hire us to be stunt guys in movies, because we make the <laughs> you smoked. We make the sickest scenes. You should get out of that car before you die. Smoked. Smoke on the first one. Yeah, what happened there? You slowed down. I just down. started turning the wheel side to oh. side and it started to uh, It was catching too much grip. Yeah, it was it's crazy how many tires we've actually gone through down here like I would I don't want to say a hundred yet but it's probably getting up there so. we should, uh, should throw a little more dirt up top here so our bumpers can push right into it yeah I know we keep climbing up the hill farther and farther we started down here but now we're here yeah start from the bottom well, now we're now we're midway three, four feet ahead <laughs> uh, surprise these plants are still alive <laughs> with all the smoke yeah uh, Anyways, as per usual, thank you guys for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed it. We just wanted to do a quick one today. We got a super busy week. We're going to get some moto in. We're going to do the mods to the Maverick. I hope you guys are excited. I know I bought the Maverick and said I wasn't going to do anything to it, but I lie to myself every day. Let's be let's every be serious. Every truck owner ever. Not even going to touch a daily yeah. driver. Yeah. Lift daily. it up, do this, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Um, yeah, thank you guys as always. Check out the links below. Support the team. Check out Evo Power Sports, especially if you have a side by side. They're great guys. They're number one in like modding all that crap out and you know adding the horsepower and they do all the testing. So that's why I went with them and nobody else because I trust them and they're great guys. So as always, leave some comments. Let me know what you think. Let me know what you think of Justin and follow him. Follow us. You know. We do lots on Instagram. There's a lot on Instagram that we don't actually post to YouTube. And there's a lot of stories on Instagram that we don't post to YouTube. So it's always nice to have you guys watch, like, you know, the other behind the scenes that don't, yeah. doesn't ever get to see YouTube. A lot so. of behind the scenes stuff that never makes the cut. Yeah. Or it should, but YouTube won't like it. Yeah. There's, so all that <laughs> exclusive stuff is on Instagram. There's tons of hours of footage that never even, that just gets tossed on the floor. So thank you guys as always. Have a fantastic day, fantastic week. Go watch some other videos and we'll see you later.